Should a gang stain gang, should a gang strong. Should a gang stain gang, should a gang strong. So this is students, man. So one of my subscribers, man, they sent me a video. You know what I'm saying? He asked me to react to. I seen it. It was about um so being motivational, you know, stuff like that. I watched a little bit of it. I think he did a good job, so I'm gonna go ahead and react to it, man. I got you, bro. Don't have friends. You wonder why you don't have friends. Let me go ahead and get in. right. You probably feel lonely. You probably feel left out. You probably feel like you're missing out on all the action. You probably feel like you're not pretty enough, probably. You probably feel like you're not cool enough. You might feel like you don't have enough cool gear. You might feel like you can't hang with the rest of them. You might feel like you can't drink with the rest. You can't smoke with the rest. You just might feel like you were lame in life. You might feel like you're not popular enough. Already, off this first 40 seconds, bro. Come on, bro. This nigga so be talking that shit, dog. Look what I'm doing on my birthday, bro. Today is my birthday. I'm supposed to be... I'm supposed to be doing something that everybody else do, right? I'm supposed to be what? Shopping or something? Do I'm supposed to be, like, going to get drunk or turning up or something? Get ready to go hit a club or something? Do I'm supposed to be going to go buy new outfits or something? Out of everything I want, millions of fans, millions of subscribers, I was still high and shit, bro. Hey, when you realize, bro, you don't need all this clothes and all this shit, when you really realize, bro, it's like changing new tires on a car every day. It just don't make sense to have 50, 100 pair of shoes, or, unless it just truly makes you happy, but everybody gonna say it. I have bashed so many people. I have destroyed so many people. Happiness made people quit YouTube. I fed on all of it. I ate it for lunch. One thing I didn't know was what depression really was. One thing I didn't know was you, with the energy you put out is what you receive with them. So one day, everything, my, bro, my life started crashing. All y'all that's here, y'all know. I couldn't stream no more. Police kept coming to my door. My house kept getting raided for no reason. It's like everything was taking me away from myself. And I had a spiritual awakening. If you if, if you fuck with this video, go ahead and make sure you hit a like under this, man. Whoever, whoever, let's see who who made this, man. You need your you need your due diligence, man. The spot to laugh, man. Make sure I subscribe to the spot to laugh, man. This is a great video, bro. It's a great video. I want you to know, if you one of them persons out there, no matter, if you one of them people out there, no matter if you a boy or a girl, I want you to know you are in the best position you have ever been in in your entire life. If you was to look at it and really know the position that you are in, man, little do you know, your life is waiting on you to make that change. You are about to become something way more than any of this shit you feel like you're not fitting in to be in you are in a position to change your life around and become something way a nigga drop a hundred if he listen to this shit bro a nigga drop a hundred before his high school game bro a nigga drop a hundred uh, you feel me blue strip a better with no interruptions understand what you going through is billions of other people that's going through the same thing you're not the only person stressed and depressed it's billions of people going through worse. Facts. They need you. So you need to get your shit together. You need to pick yourself up. It's people that depend on you. You got to understand that. It's all on you. Take responsibility. When is the last time you looked at yourself in the mirror and thanked yourself for all the shit you've been through through life? You have to start loving yourself. You need to start doing everything you possibly can that has to do with self-love. Don't nobody have to... Bro, if people call you ugly, who gives a f***? So? That shit 
hurt you? This is who I am. Y'all see this nigga come on this camera with a do-rag on, some nappy-ass dreads. Bro, this is who I am. I'm not trying to look pretty for nobody. I'm not trying to get sexy for nobody. You gonna set me for who the fuck I am or you just not gonna fuck with me? Cause I'm not going out my way to change for any fucking body. I've been this same nigga that wear hats and do-rags for the past four and a half, five years. Gained millions of fuck followers, millions of subscribers, whatever you wanna call it. Made helly money. I have accomplished so much things being who the fuck I want to be. This is who I am. I love me, bro. The fact that I love me, other people. Yeah, I remember that video. You feel me? I remember that video. That's funny. I remember that video. People have to love me because I'm confident in myself. I'm not walking around looking at somebody like they above me. That's why I told y'all I hate fame. Because I don't want people to look at me like I'm something that they can't be or I'm above them. But you can do the same shit I'm doing and everybody else doing. They put these people on these high pedestals to make you feel bad about yourself. Like you got like you got to reach a certain level in this fucking matrix. Like the only level you need to reach is loving yourself. You have to really understand. God chose you for a bigger purpose. Think about it. And how can niggas, bro, and y'all wonder why I be on niggas like dub ass, bro, nigga. How can you hate on a man like this, bro? How could you legitimately hate on a man like this, bro? And y'all be like, bro, crazy, why are you on these niggas ass, bro? What? Is y'all crazy, bro? Is y'all crazy? Look around you. Everybody sleep. We all we got. It's not a lot of us. People call us crazy. Demonic. They give us all type of crazy ass names. Yet, we know more about their life than they do. Yet, they are the ones stressed, depressed, spread in fear to everyone. Right? Y'all don't know what real love is unless you connect them with what's within you. Bro, a lot of people go watch this video like, yeah, he's speaking that real, but you got to really understand what he talk about, bro. A lot of people don't like themselves. And if you liked it yourself, bro, you, you wouldn't be so easy to program, bro, if you liked it yourself, bro. Because you would know what you really want, what you really liked it, bro. And just, you got to be smart, man. Common sense, they're taking it away. Common sense not common no more. That's the same love. Nothing can replace that. Once you experience that real love within you, you would know you don't have to go out here chasing anything. No, like, bro, you can accomplish as many goals as you want. It's not going, it's not, it's not approving what's within you, bro. I tried to tell y'all that no matter how rich you get, no matter how much money you make, no matter how many trophies, etc., you get, it is not improving what's within you. You have to go within, connect with yourself, pay attention to how you feel. When you start getting mad, be aware that you're getting mad. Be like, okay, you feel that pain coming. That pain is not you. You are the one that's aware of that pain. So if you get depressed, you think you're depressed. You're not really depressed. Trust me. We all have been there. We all have to go through something. The fact that you have, you said you have. You know what this give me? This give me, do y'all remember my 30 for 30? This give me my 30 for 30 vibes. It's a great video, man. Motivation is key. I have no friends, right? I wish I could hit the reset button on some of the people that came into my life and stole my energy. I want you to know you're not missing out on anything in the fucking world. You parties, fuck a party. Anything, you're not missing out on nothing. You are in a position nobody is interrupting you. You don't have nobody to call you and drag you into bullshit. You can literally make the path and make your life whatever you want to be right now. You in the bet for all y'all that think y'all are lame, y'all have nobody to call on, bro. You are in a position to love yourself more than you have ever had in your entire life. As long as you love yourself, you don't need nobody. If you only knew that, it's hard to love yourself when you are a part of groups. 
when you are a part of groups, you're lost in the matrix. I hope you know that. If you are a part of a squad, a group, a gang, you are lost in the matrix. It's impossible for you to, especially if all y'all not even on the same tip. Groups is what's keeping y'all lost. So for you that sit at home missing out on all these parties and shit, think about all the time in the world that you have to change your life. Bro, at this time, this video is so good, I, I, I just got to be a witness. I can't even react, you feel me? I don't even want to cut this shit off. Speak on, bro. Speak on. Come on. And what I mean by changing your life around, find what you really love to do. Your higher self don't want you hanging with these people. Your higher self don't want you into this drama. Y'all y'all, y'all need to know. Y'all connect with your higher self all the time, every single day. You just got to know. Your higher self is the reason why you be feeling all good randomly. You don't be, sometimes you just don't be feeling all good, like with a lot of energy sometimes, and then it just go away. Or your higher self is when you feel like you have the answers, like you just all of a sudden just smart. You ain't read no books or nothing. You just smart. You got the answer. That's your higher self coming in, giving you the knowledge. If, your, if, if, if you can't hang with these certain groups, then it's not meant for you to be with them. Every person that's, that, that's on this channel, I be preaching to y'all every day. You need no friends. Friends are a distraction from you loving yourself. You don't need nobody to love yourself. Everybody that comes in your life will take you away from loving yourself. Because you feel like they, you need love from all these other people. You need to fit in. You need to go to this party. If you're not there, you missing out. You lame. You need Instagram followers. You need to follow all this shit to fit in. The reason why you don't have none of that right now, and you want it so desperately bad, you probably think about it every day. The reason why you don't have none of that or not doing none of that or hanging around people or have a lot of friends or popular is because you have a way bigger purpose. I want y'all to know it don't matter how y'all, it don't matter. Bro, this nigga is bro. I hope y'all getting something out of this, man. I'm just sitting back listening to greatness. You feel me? I hope y'all get something out of this. Like I said, man, I ain't gonna keep pausing too much because I'm just gonna let this flow, man. This is a, a beauty of art. We have to let this flow. You feel me? Matter how you look, at all. It don't matter. It don't matter if you think you ugly and all. It's weird. It don't matter. You can do and be anything you want as long as you facing your shit. Get out of your comfort zone. Y'all been fucking with me for this long, and I have never showed y'all my hairline or none of that shit. It's stuff about me. I had everything I want. Millions of fans. Y'all accepted me for who I was. But I still wasn't good within myself with myself. Now I feel free. I feel like I left a lot. Of, I, I, I left, let off a lot of weight. It's all about your energy and how you That's it. You got the infinity on. But listen. What I'm trying to tell you, you got rappers like Kodak Black. Like, look at Lil Baby. I ain't gonna lie. Lil Baby ugly as shit. The nigga ugly. <laughs> Glowing. Little baby is little baby. Anyway, y'all. Uh, love yourself, man. Take care of yourself. Be free. Who cares? Man, it don't matter how you look. Just be free. Accept that shit. Accept your flaws. Hey, for the people who's having a bad day, man, here you go, bro. React to shit in the building. Once again, we want to thank the spot to laugh, man. He should do. He deserve way more subscribers, man. He got a few more videos, good videos too. Go ahead and let him know. Shoot a game, brought y'all here, man. Shoot a game, stand game, shoot a game, show, man. We out. That was a good video.